Hi there, welcome to the channel. My name's John and today I'm going to be taking you through the Panda Nomi 3D by Big Tree Tech. This was actually sent to me by the guys over there and uh, I would just like to say a big thank you for that. So what we're going to do is we're going to look at what's actually in the box, well, boxes and um and then we're going to put it together and show it on the printer i'll be putting it on the bamboo air one these ones particular are for the bamboo air one so yeah that's the printer we'll be putting it on today so yeah if that interests you please stick around so here we have the panda nomi 3d it comes in the two boxes like i said earlier one has the case only inside and the other one has the screen so we'll open this one first to see what we get We got a nice card here with the uh, QR code there to get the to, to their wiki page and the latest firmware. Let's keep that safe. We get uh, a little ducky right there. Um, so we have um, a cable. another cable um, the actual VQ Panda Nomi 3D version 1 screen in there you get the screen itself um, another power cable and a big tree tech sticker also get one two three four five six seven zip ties and that's everything in the first box the second box uh, another QR code and what looks like the screen um, a piece of glass or plastic and another part of the screen right there and that's everything in the box so let's have a look at putting this together Okay, so I've scanned the QR code for the wiki and it's give us the mounting guide right here. Uh, pretty simple instructions to go through. So let's get this over to the printer and get it installed. Right, so the first thing I'm gonna do is we're gonna take this out and there was a, a, a sticker on the front there that I peeled off. Make sure you peel that sticker off. Uh, it's like a protective cover. Uh, then we take our actual casing right here and we put in the, the piece like that, the domed piece. And then we get our Nomi display. Pop it in that way around, like so. Then we get this piece here. This piece needs to go in a certain way, so we put it in left hand side first then right hand side and push and you'll feel it pop in and that is the the piece in its case now we need to get it onto here so take your front panel off take your wheel out and then what we need to do is we need to get the power cable that comes with the normie and we're going to feed that through this little hole here <clears throat> and then that plugs into your port on the back
And then you put the top part on first and then push on the bottom. Now this cable itself, there is a, a clip that you can buy, uh, sorry, a clip that you can print off, um, which can go, it goes on there to hold it out of the way. And at the end of the power cable, you've got these two male connectors, which plug into your two female connectors on this smaller piece here. And you've got your four pin connector, which if you've got the A1, you'll have a spare one around the rear of the machine. And we're just gonna plug that straight into there. Excuse the cable management, but I've put the power back in. I'm just gonna turn the machine on. Please scan the QR code with your camera app to configure the network for this device. So let's do that. Yeah, so we're in preview mode at the moment. I hope you can see that uh, properly. But uh, yeah, at the moment we're in standby, but I just want to go through the different modes as the printer's doing certain things. So this is what it would look like when the um, the nozzle's heating. You get a nice little graphic there. and Obviously it gives you your temperature of what it's heating to. Currently, obviously it's at 16 degrees, but uh, that'll change when we actually put a print on. Uh, this is what it looks like when the bed's heating. Hopefully you can see that. Then you've got your bed leveling. Uh, your homing. Nozzle cleaning. Your floor calibration. Your XY mesh mode, a filament check, a filament cut. <laughs> These are pretty cool. Uh, you've got your, as it's pushing the filament, purge. When the print's okay, when the print's actually printing, and if you get an error on the printer itself. You can change these. You can update them with any uh, GIF that you like, um, but uh, these are the ones that come standard. Pretty cool, pretty neat piece of kit. Okay, so that's the Panda Nomi by Big Tree Tech. Thanks again, Big Tree Tech, for sending me out this, uh, this piece of kit. I've also got a few other little bits and pieces as well sent out by them, and I will be putting them out later on. If you've enjoyed this, then please Feel free to hit the thumbs up button and also um, if I've got any questions about this particular product or anything else, stick a comment in the uh, comment section. And by all means, consider subscribing to the channel because that really does help us. And so I will put the link to this particular product in the description as well. That is an affiliate link, so if you do actually purchase one of these through that, then I will receive a very small commission for that as well as a thank you. But yeah, until next time guys, I'll see you all later.